You're watching 13 on your side. It's a common tool criminals use and it's not going away anytime soon. People in West Michigan and all across the country for that matter have fallen victim to identity theft because of these electronic devices, credit and debit card skimmers. Crooks fit them into gas pumps, automatic teller machines, and they just walk away and wait for you to come by and steal your card information and money. But lately, people have been posting on social media about a potential new way to detect those skimmers. 13 on your side, Shanna Grove joins us now to verify. Does it really work, Shanna? Hey, Nick, to verify if you can simply pull up the Bluetooth on your phone to scam for those skinners, we paid a visit to the chief operating officer of the IT company, Trivalent Group. People are sharing this tip all over social media. It says when you pull up to a gas station to fill your car, search your phone for Bluetooth devices. If a sequence of letters and a sequence of numbers shows up in your device list, do not pay at the pump. One of the pumps has a card reader installed. All card readers are Bluetooth. Let's break this into two questions. One, can the Bluetooth sensor on a mobile phone detect some types of card skimmers? Two, are all card skimmers Bluetooth? Let's tackle the first question about using your phone's Bluetooth to detect skimmers. Yeah, some types. The type of skimmer that transfers data using Bluetooth. The skimmer itself is going to collect the data the same way that a, an older type of skimmer would. But with the Bluetooth, that bad actor can be sitting in their car 50 feet away and receiving information from the skimmer. Bluetooth is a more sophisticated method, which answers our second question. Not all skimmers are Bluetooth. The old kind, the, the, the bad actor had to put the skimmer in the pump, so you have to break the seal and, and tamper with the pump. But then it downloaded to an SD card or, or USB key or whatever else. You had to go back to the pump to get the data. If you want to take a look the next time you're paying at the pump, Here's how it works. If you go into settings and in Bluetooth and then it will scan for Bluetooth the devices, that would be where you would go within proximity, five to 15 feet ish of a possible skimmer. It's gonna be this long string of letters and numbers. It just, you know, 16, 20 characters long. Just know it's not going to find all types of skimmers and might detect other completely innocent devices. If you do the scan, and you see something that is not obvious, it's not a speaker or headphones or your car or whatever else, err on the side of caution. Just go to a different pump and, and, and make sure that it's clean or a different gas station or whatever else. I mean, it's, it's not likely you're going to find something, but it's possible. There are also apps out there like this one, Card Skimmer Locator, that are created to help you locate skimmers, which can be more user friendly than just your phone's Bluetooth alone. Although this is a pretty fascinating way to detect skimmers, our IT expert says you're probably just better off looking for signs of physical tampering at the pump and staying in well-lit areas close to the store. Nick. All good stuff, Shanna. Thank you.